All right, gentlemen, listen up. Today is one small step for Twitch and one large step for s -Fan. Starfield is coming out and it is time for us to go and to play some Starfield, gentlemen. I'm gonna be honest, I did not know how bad that was gonna get. Nice moon socks. Thank you. All right, Starfield, here it is. Okay, new, start a new game, confirm. Beth Bethesda Game Studios presents. It has come to our attention that there is a fatal gas leak on board the spacecraft. To prevent catastrophic engine failure, we need to put a 12 centimeters diameter cork in S Fan's bunghole to prevent the hot toxic gas from seeping is this, out. Is this a part of the game? For the love of all that is space, good. place, Oxygen's space, good. oddity. Just do what you did last time, and you're fine. Follow my one simple rule. Hella, what's my one simple Listen rule? Listen to Lynn. Boss lady knows best. Exactly. Listen to me. Mining's <laughs> just like any other awake. job. Classic. Go steady. Go safe. Go home with a pocket full of credits at the end of the day. Yeah, totally. It's just like, um, now I work in the Star Dock. Except uh, with more cave-ins, lasers, and accidental dismemberment. Very helpful. Thank you. Ah, you're gonna be fine. Your first outing was solid. And, you know, let's be honest, it ain't exactly astrophysics. That's why I keep him around. Good pep talks. Yeah. And the fact that I can pinpoint a helium deposit from 300 meters. <laughs> Not untrue. A shame we won't find any down here. But the metal deposits alone should pay for our own helium. Hell, after this, we'll have enough jump fuel to bounce from one end of the settled systems to the next. Hey, more minerals, more money. And so the cycle repeats itself. Just no more unauthorized jumps in the house for room space, okay? He's just a big baby. There are worse lives. You know, most Dusties don't even make it this far. I have a good feeling about you. A group hug now or at the end of the shift? <sighs> one of these days, Hella, I am going to leave. Hide. Promises, promises. Is your height metric 182, 183? Uh, you think we'll be done here soon? Hey, <gasps> Sorry, I didn't know I could do that. All right, so I guess I get to these points. I'm busy. Anyone else to bother? Beryllium added. You know what somebody said? Somebody earlier said, I just tuned in and the first thing I see is s fan It's like, how is that different from any other stream? There's literally every stream is like, hello? And for a flashlight, it said on the screen. Yeah, I said I can't see. Oh, you have to hold it. I, I hit it and it's not, it doesn't work when you hit it, you have to hold you it. See anything? Oh, wow, look at that. Oh, look, it's floating. Sleep the whole time? Come on. Come on. Okay, take it easy. You were out cold. Uh, no physical damage. Mentally, the jury's still out. You know who you are? New recruit for Argos Extractors? Ring any bells? Any of this look familiar? Okay, here we go, chat. The best part of any game character creation. Let's see. Huh? Oh, look at that. 
<laughs> dude, look at Buzz Lightyear, dude. Is there a long hair? I bet there's no long hair. I think the best thing for me is the man bun, right? Background, Beast Hunter. Bouncer, you've worked the line at the toughest clubs in the settled systems. Bounty Hunter, Chef, Combat Medic, Cyber Runner. Wait, is there a Great Negotiator? Persians are Great Negotiators. Where is Great Negotiator? Persuasion, Commerce, and Wellness. You're a diplomat, but you just shoot people. Okay, I'm gonna be a diplomat, chat. Traits, you have three traits. Hero worshipped. You've earned the attention of an annoying, adoring fan who'll show up randomly and jabber at you incessantly. And the plus side, I'll join your ship's crew and give you- Wait, a stream- a stream sniper? Wait, is this a stream saver? I just feel like this is gonna be funny. Wanted. Stream snipers. Actually, it's hero worshipped and wanted. You have just stream snipers everywhere and then taxes. S fanned. Huh, forgot. Former diplomat, right? You must have said the wrong words to the wrong people to wind up here. Well, you got the sample. Clients on his way, no then we all get paid. You remember anything that happened? There was this light and music. Huh. Well, you passed out, that's for sure. Everything else, probably just your brain playing tricks. Either way, we got what we were looking for. All this trouble for that stupid thing? Huh. Sure don't look like much. Never mind what it looks like. It's worth more than this mine has pulled in all month. We'll be... Speak of the devil. Play the game and stop pausing FFS. Kind of I'm joke. pausing so I can give you Not time to suck joke. my butt. All right, Dusty. Airlock. Put your helmet on. Oh, it's on. Can you Hell, breathe? No. Okay, equip a helmet. Tallywatch quest is tracked. Okay. Helmet, none equipped. Deep mining space helmet. Okay, it's equipped. Dude, the graphics are nuts. It's a little bit foggy, but it looks nuts. Super good. Man. Man. Been a long time. Gordon Freeman? <laughs> yes, it is. <laughs> it's Barney. That mine on Bindi, right? Kazal, hellhole, like this place. Rare mineral contract. Your tastes are a bit more sophisticated now, huh? So, you found something? Right here. The new guy found it. The new guy? All right. Hello, I have a name. And everything went cool? Just like grabbing those minerals on Bendy? Kazal. And no, Barrett. Not cool. He passed out after the extraction. Woke up saying all kinds of nonsense. Is that right, cowboy? Went on a trip, huh? Uh, you could call it that. <laughs> that fun, huh? Not the most gentle push into the great mysteries of space, but hey, been there. Barrett, the scanners on the frontier are reporting a ship coming in hot for yeah, of course. I of course really not. thought I lost them. Barrett? Thanks for watching, Scott. Hold off the pirates, optional, grab a weapon. Wait, where do we grab our weapon from? What is this? Neon pistol, weapon case, med pack? Yeah, it's a pistol now. Can't take it! I need some help here! Oh, frick! I crit, I crit. Wait, I think we got them all. Guys, I think we killed them all. We're good. Oh, frick. Oh no, a miner died. Wait, a bunch of miners are dead. 
kill the head bones. Okay. What are you guys shooting at? Oh my gosh, did we, did we pick up a gun, by the way? Tab, inventory, weapons. Oh, we did. A rescue axe and a maelstrom. Of course Barrett was being followed. Every time. You dug up the artifact, right? That means you saw it. The visions? You're coming with me to Constellation. You're part of this now. If you take me off this damn moon, sign me up. Vasco, get him to the lodge. No deviations unless absolutely necessary, okay? Protocol Indigo. Indigo? Again? Very well. Oh, and hey, take this. You'll find it very useful out there. And it even tells the time. Hey, look at that. The watch fits you perfectly. Now, questions? You give me your ship? Technically, it's not even mine. Consider it alone. Vasco will keep you on course. Besides, I'm making an exception, since you can tell Constellation about that vision you had. Why send me? Shouldn't you go? Come on. You're really not at all curious about that light music show you experienced? Why it only affected you? Because if you didn't notice, we've all been handling it since with no problem. The way I see it, Constellation needs that artifact, but they also need you. This mystery is only getting bigger each step we take. And you're part of it now. And Vasco, don't let him break my ship. It appears you are the new captain of the frontier. Ooh. Here in the space station, we have very futuristic food that's not real. You will think it's real McDonald's, but this is actually fake McDonald's. Mmm, they 3D print this meals in space now. They're delicious. Ronald McDonald has been dead for 2,000 years. After the Great Burger Wars, all the fast food joints have been dead. Fly close to shipwrecks and press E to loot them. Uh, dude, this is, this is like kind of hard. Two more Crimson Fleet ships are jumping into our location, Captain. Dude, oh my. Oh, frick. It takes so long to return, man. It's so, it takes so long to turn. So I go fast you turn, yeah, I'm pressing S and moving. Like I'm reversing to try and turn faster. I don't I don't even know if it's working. Nice! As in far more than anticipated. Sick! We didn't lose to the tutorial chat. Let's go! So you can left click to set landing target. So this has been explored. Argos Extractors Mining Outpost. That's where we came from. Look at these other ships, the neighbors. Are people complaining about this game? I haven't seen anything yet. Uh, because it's a new game that just came out and it didn't cure all of their life's problems. So they, they assume the game is bad because it didn't like give them like a, a like religious awakening or something. I feel like new games come out and there's like things to criticize and stuff, but I feel like the overabundance of criticism a lot of new games is like, it, it all stems from the fact that people legit thought it was gonna like change their life or change their lives. You know? Shit was landing on you. Oh, no, I was saying like, honestly what happens a lot of times is like, there's there's legitimate things to like criticize or whatever like a new game comes out it's like oh I wish this was better I wish that was better or that, that's not very good but then what happens is like these games get so overhyped that people just there's this unrealistic expectation that like it's just gonna like fix their entire life or something absurd you know yeah Peter Molyneux they're gonna have like some like Peter Molyneux level of like awakening that's gonna happen can I just shoot anybody 
Dude, I just cranked this guy three bullets in the side of the head. Why is everybody here armed? New Texas. True. Does it feel too much like Fallout? Uh, I didn't play Fallout, actually. But from what I know, Fallout's like a great game. So it felt if it feels like Fallout, wouldn't that be a good thing? Dude, in a game like this, it's gonna be very hard for me to not walk around and just like crank people in the face. Sorry, I should, I need to stop. I need to actually play the game. Sorry. <laughs> like how, dude, the guard is trying to like protect the people and he just starts spraying into the crowd. Like what the hell? This is New Atlantis Transit or the NAT. It provides free transportation throughout the city. Let's go to the Mass District. We can take it directly to the Mass District. Is that how you feel at conventions? No, I don't feel like randomly what running around cranking people in the face at conventions, okay? Yeah, I would say so far, the, the environments are like very impressive. Graphics are good, environments are impressive. All that kind of stuff is kind of like a given in, in a lot of games these days. Uh, well, I'll say graphics. Graphics being good is kind of like a given. I don't put a lot of like stake into like good graphics. But environment, and like the environment being cool, that that's another thing, like the design. Like I think this looks sick. I think this city looks badass. Can I just talk to anybody? Welcome to Feeling Realty. I'm Zora, and I'm here to help with whatever you may need. It's crazy, because like even just talking to somebody, you immediately know that this is a Bethesda game. Bethesda games just have like the look. You know, like they have like a very specific type of stare. Stop by anytime. Dude, I want to punch her in the face so bad, man. Oh, we gotta find out if there's a way I can play this game where I can just run around and just start punching everybody in the face and not get in trouble. Oh my god, bro. Oh, <laughs> Look at the way she's looking at me, dude. Dude, she was actually come on bro me, dude. Look at her. Look at her. Dude. What? That's hilarious. Wait, I forgot to save. <laughs> I set up a hotkey for quick save and I... And I forgot to save. Captain, everyone will be in the library, just inside. If Barrett were here, he'd probably tell you that you're part of something bigger now. And he hopes you'll make this place your home. Welcome to Constellation. We have a lot to talk about. Thank you guys for the subs. Would you care to tell us what happened to our friend? Why you're here and he isn't? Pirates attack, bear ask me to deliver artifact. It doesn't matter, I have your artifact. Yeah. I see. Okay. Bosco, verify. All statements made have been factual. Ugh. This is just typical. Bear hands over our ship and our robot to some random employee of a discount mining outfit he uses. Walter. And if we hadn't insisted on installing those emergency protocols, I guarantee you this rock breaker here would be halfway to Neon. But that didn't happen. He's here with the artifact. Thank you, Matteo. Now, let's focus on what's in front of us, shall we? Can you breathe in this? Not really. It's kind of like I'm wearing a plastic bag on my head. Oh my god, that's it. They're reacting. Look at how it's coming together. Oh, they're reacting, they're reacting? Parking between them, no manufactured material in the cell systems can do that. None of them. This proof. Easy, girl. Breathe. You'll have a heart attack. She's not the only one. <laughs> if they're coming together, that means there's a set. Built by an intelligence outside the settled systems. Still 2,000 credits for our little wager, Godfrey? You're on, Walter. Well. If we had all the answers, it wouldn't be exciting, now would it? Not to take away from the moment, but what are we going to do about our new friend? <laughs> so, are you ready to get to work? See if exploration is the life you want to lead in this little universe of ours? Alright, I'm in. You should take some time to get settled in. Introduce yourself to everyone. Some of our members aren't here, but you'll meet them soon. Come find me when you're ready. You and I are going to be doing some traveling together. Get your feet wet. 
And here. I think you've earned something for bringing the artifact to us. In addition to credits, why don't we set you up with a backpack with some boost capability? Hmm? You'll need oh, it out in the field nice. anyway. Just mind your head. Good thing you've got me around, Ms. Morgan. Who knows how you'd get by on your own. Nonsense, Walter. Your sparkling personality is why we love you. The credits are just a bonus. <laughs> Dude, I love this. Expected to end up involved in something the diplomat, like this. baby. They call me the diplomat. I'm gonna go down. Ever since I got here, I'll take my this is not this. These people are family. I hope it feels that way for you too. Dude, this is so funny, man. I'm gonna last much longer. Hold on. I'm gonna go down. <laughs> Dude, I love that. I love being able to do stuff like that in games. Of course. Dude, the things they say are so funny, dude. It's so like, I haven't even played a lot of these games, but it's so like classic Bethesda, dude. Everybody knows. I can't be a part of this, like stuff like that. Okay, let's look at our quest. Press L, go to main, mission old neighborhood. Ask about My uh, Mayora and Sidonia. <laughs> Monka W quick save. Dude, every time you see me quick save, it's Monka W. It's Oh, no, he's quick saving. He's gonna murder somebody. Oh my gosh. Adoring fan is a stream cyber. By Vectera, by Vectera, by Vectera! I can't believe it! Is it you? Is it really, really you? Captain of the frontier, bane of the fleet. Constellations shining star of stars. Get away from me, you weirdo. Oh, you must have me confused with someone who isn't your number one fan. There's nothing weird about that. Although for a second, I didn't even recognize you. Shame on me. But now that I know it's you... Dude, I love this. What are the odds? And to think, I almost went for coffee instead. So this guy has been in been in Bethesda games since Oblivion. They just keep bringing him back. Oh, you accidentally hit me. Ow! Were you trying to hit something behind me? <laughs> oh, you hit me. Oh, sweeties, this guy on the team. He can go get us ice cream while you weapon. play this game. Oh. Hit me! It's strange that it seemed to come from your direction. Oh! Oh my God! Are you doing this on purpose? No way! I am not going to help you murder these people. What? Finish him! Are you insane? Well, I suppose they're not going to need it anymore. <laughs> I think it's weird. And she's like, are you insane? I think it's weird. She's like, hey. Until next time, there will be a next time. Uh, won't there? Hey, there'll be plenty of time for shooting later. But I apologize for getting in your way. <laughs> Ow! Were you trying to hit something behind me? <laughs> <laughs> Why the hell did you do that? Not gonna last much longer. Dude, I need Until this is so time, funny to me, dude. I have to stop. There will be a next time. Dude, it's so funny. 
So let's see, missions. The old neighborhood, ask about more on Sardonia, be to show on map. It's been going on about the heart of Mars again. Goes. Well, how about off to observe? Serving drinks here for over 40 years. A few places can offer that kind of stability. I'm looking for a Vanguard named Moira. He ain't been around. Went off on patrol. Hasn't been back in since. We're starting to think it might be time to pour one out to the blackest sea. We could be the only ones who could find him. Maybe. All right, I'll give up. Just trying to earn a living here. Last time, Jim Moera kept yelling about the Lady of Love, just singing songs, all that kind of thing. Venus? That's only one planet. Hardly an entire patrol route. I got what I got, okay? <sighs> Fine. We'll make do. Beer teeny! A mixture of beer and vodka. Definitely an acquired taste. I can't be a part of this. What? All right, let's, okay, let's see where we go next here. Oh, this doesn't honestly, this doesn't really feel right. Go to Venus. Go to Venus. If I hit show on map, I do L here. We're gonna show on map. B show on map. Alert all space travelers. Be on watch of a space fugitive named Esven TV. Long hair, five foot four. And smells like corn. Wanted Wait, five foot four? I'm, I'm six feet. And body pillows. Okay, most of those things aren't true. We can dock? Oh, hail. Hail or dock? Hail. We're just gonna dock. Okay. Board the ship. So, where to next? China. <laughs> dude, the timing was so good, dude. Dude, my brain didn't even like, 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 oh, this be register it at first. Chat, can I get carbon dioxide poisoning like this? Am I gonna die? Yeah, I'll wear it like this. Wait, you know what this looks like? You know what this reminds me of is alien isolation. Bro, I punched the tank. All I did was punch the tank, dude. Dude, okay, this is bad, dude. I'm, I'm taking, I'm taking like, a lot of hits. Where's girl? Where's Stacy? Uh, Sarah Morgan. Where'd she go. Stacy, I don't know. I, did, I forgot. <laughs> I thought her name was Stacy's mom. Dude, she's stuck. Okay. Dude, Stacy. How do you, how do you say? I'm stuck. Oh. oh, nice. Okay, we pushed her out. We pushed her out. I can't oh. Shoot! Come on. No. Dude, she is actually worthless. She doesn't do anything. 
At least mods will make her naked. Dude, is that what you guys do? Do you guys just like play video games in your room alone all day with the lights off and just have like mods where the we females are naked? You got me. Maybe you gave her brain damage from the amount of punching you gave her. Oh yeah, maybe that's actually my fault she's bad. Something's out there. Oh frick, I'm out of ammo! Chat, look at this guy. It's called the Coachman. Okay, chat, we're gonna run the Coachman for a little bit. seem very good. I think we're not gonna do that one anymore. That's Moana's? Actually, not a bad plan. Much better odds destroying one of their ships than fighting them all at once here. On, on, Sarah, I need to give you this. Dude, I'm trying to give her items in combat and it doesn't let me. I have to wait until combat's over, but I don't know where the bad guys are. Oh, that was badass, dude! So you can just pick up a bunch of this random stuff and you can just vendor it. I have a lot of aluminum. So I need two aluminum, two amino acids, and three antimicrobials. Interesting. Okay, so this is like the research trees. Okay, pilot seat. All right. Are we done? Are we, are we done here? Go to Neptune. Okay, I guess we're done here, man. Show on map. How do I visit my dream? Oh, oh S-Fan's home right here, okay. Land. Okay, we're gonna see the home chat. This was one of my traits was I got a home. Okay, everybody get ready, pause. JK, thank you for the 30 month prime. Thanks, dude. Is that it? Is that my house? S fans home location discovered. Now bank has locked your house until you make an interest-only mortgage payment of Oh my. Your payment gives you one week of access before the next payment is due until mortgage- Okay. Dude, are you kidding- Are you kidding me, man? Here, let's pay the credits. We'll pay the credits. We gotta see this thing. 
Wait, this is a nice house. Decorate, industrial workbench. I can get a helmet display, weapon rack, variants, QT, oh wait. There's a bunch of different types of chairs. Dude, I bet people spend so much time in this place, dude. Wow, look at this, this look at this shower. This is a nice shower. <laughs> Heck, look at this patio. You can sit in this game? What the frick, look at that cutscene for sitting. Okay, so we have like some quests to do here, man. We got some things to do, okay. Guys, thank you guys so much for joining me today for Starfield. Uh, I, dude, I actually had a blast, man. I, I actually had a blast. I mean, I would say this game is pretty good. There's some degree of aimlessness, a small degree of it, but I know it's my own fault because I just cannot help but go and just like start just beating that piss out of random NPCs. That's my fault, okay? So I recognize that. But I mean, I would say so far after like playing the game for a few hours, my, my initial impression of the game, I'd say it's probably about an eight without really like getting too deep into it. Some of the map navigation and stuff, I don't know why it's, it's it feels so unintuitive for me. Uh, but again, I think that's a me issue. I don't think that's an issue with the game. The combat feels very fun. Uh, I, I like the item, the, you know, the, the gearing systems and stuff seem really fun. I, yeah, I've barely scratched the surface. So, so my initial like day one impression, I'd say it's probably an eight. I hope you guys enjoyed. We'll probably continue playing this tomorrow. We'll get a better taste of it tomorrow. But if you guys are watching this on YouTube, if you guys can leave a like, leave a comment, let me know what you think about Starfield. Let me know what you think about the video. And uh, we'll see you guys on stream or we'll see you guys on the next YouTube video. So thanks for watching. We'll see you guys next time. Oh,